we created uh, PriorityMemberService.com as a uh, portal. We, we're uh, working uh, principally with Amazon-based uh, cloud solutions to support our Shortel ECC deployments. A lot of times it's a little easier if we just provide the uh, Linux, MySQL, PHP development environment uh, as well as the mail server to support uh, Shortel custom integrations uh, rather than uh, waste a lot of time trying to figure out the client's uh, IT infrastructure. I uh, hope we're pleased to work with their infrastructure but at the same time uh, to, to marshal aggressively a new uh, integration to market we have um, our priority member services.com a domain name. It's a generic domain name. So if you were to get a, an email from customer service at priorityMemberServices.com, um, that could that could very well work for you. So we have uh, PriorityMemberService.com. It's just uh, uh, the portal that overlooks our Amazon cloud deployment. Um, just a little advertising for our web chat, email to agent management, uh, text to the next available agent, web tiling, things like that. In fact, if you just go to Priority Member Services with an S, uh, you get to our text portal. And the text portal was set up uh, as the portal that clients using our text uh, solutions in their Shortel or Cisco contact center deployments. Uh, this is where you would go to log in and deal with your uh, text portal. So uh, you too, by the way, can you just go to PriorityMemberServices.com uh, and you can uh, uh, open a free account. We'll let you play with it. Um, and if you like it, keep it and just buy some more text. Um, having said that, the the interface uh, here's what it uh, would look like, um, and it, this is a telephone number associated with this client's portal, and uh, you actually can uh, add telephone numbers uh, to the um, portal. Uh, we work with uh, Twilio, Nextmo, and Plevo. And uh, you can obtain a DID number anywhere on the globe, which makes uh, the text possibilities really exciting. But the, the purpose of the par portal or the text application is that you'll, you'll create a contact list. And you create this contact list by virtue of the fact that folks will text a, a keyword to this telephone number in, in this case. And at that point, they get added to the contact list for that keyword. And I'll give you an example in a minute. These keywords have basically become groups and then you can of course uh, send an SMS message to the group. Um, we also can do voice uh, broadcast and set up auto responders for incoming messages and uh, create uh, uh, web uh, widgets that uh, enable you to do this from your website as well. There's a variety of reports that we also uh, generate. And when you log into the portal, you get this, uh, this particular interface. If I were to look, for example, uh, at my groups, I would see that um, I have a number of groups set up. And these groups, uh, these are uh, different keywords that we've set up. So, for example, uh, um, if you text the word uh, um, text my ECC, you'll get added to this contact list. And I've got that contact list set up uh, to, to, this is basically how you do it. You're going to uh, create a group, you're going to put your keyword in it, call it a subscri subscription group or a coupon group. You can have a situation where people are, are, are texting you primarily to get a free coupon or a discount coupon. Typically that's going to be a QC code or uh, uh, some other promotional uh, link uh, to a website that, where they get additional information, etc. And uh, this is um, 
how I've got this uh, set up here. Now, what we're doing with the contact center is that in addition to all of this kind of uh, uh, stuff you might do at the retail level for the contact center, um, we're, we're enabling you to send a text with a keyword that will then basically go to um, our text to email conversion. So an incoming um, uh, group is set up, it has a keyword, and then that keyword points to an email. Uh, typically, it's going to be uh, an email into your Shortel contact center, and then we use the Shortel contact center uh, routing facility to get that uh, to the next available agent. The agent can then uh, read the email, hit the reply key, and uh, send a response back uh, to the person who sent the original text in. And the whole thing uh, can be reviewed through this portal uh, where you can we archive all of the messages, both the text message in and the um, The text messages in as well as the email uh, back out. So um, at this point we're able to implement the short tell contact center um, text in um, email out solution very very quickly and um, we're also doing some text uh, self-service uh, text to uh, database access um, information back out in the form of text. So a lot happening with text. It's a very exciting medium to work with and something that uh, you should be looking at uh, adding to your contact center. So um, hope you found this informative and I thank you for viewing.